Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I know you're probably wondering where I've been the last couple of weeks, but we've been super busy. We've been invited to a lot of weekend festivals and that's the only free time that I get to build the van and the only time I get to do editing on my videos. So unfortunately the channel suffered a little bit, but I can tell you that we've got loads of content in the editing suite, which is soon to come out. A few weeks ago, we visited Camp Quirky, which is a weekend festival for self builders. And we met loads of fantastically friendly people there with some amazing vans. There were no two were alike. And that was an incredible weekend. Really enjoyed everybody's company on that. A couple of weeks ago, we were up at the NEC in Birmingham and we attended Maker Central. That's a convention for YouTube creators, much like ourselves, people that are really creative, that either make things with wood, metal, ceramics, and it's a, an exhibition where everybody can get together and share all of their knowledge and creativity. Again, another fascinating weekend, met loads of really interesting people. And later this week, we're going to be attending the Caravan and Camping Annual Camp in Alton in Staffordshire. We've been invited there by Truma, who have been sponsoring our van build. And I'm really looking forward to meeting some of the campers and caravan people up there and discussing our van build with everybody. So as you can see, we've been super busy. There's been loads going on. My weekends at the moment are the only free time I've got. So unfortunately, these weekend festivals have taken up a lot of my time. So I apologise. I know you've been waiting patiently for some updates on the van build. But let me tell you, I haven't been neglecting the van, as you can see. Any spare moment that I've got that I've been able to get in here, I've been working hard. And again, there's more content to come on the van build very, very soon. But what I wanted to share with you in this video is some amazing news and where the channel's going to go in the very near future. Our situation's changed dramatically in the last couple of years. My children are now older, they're out working and they've got their own lives. That's freed up a lot of time for ourselves. Both myself and my partner work full time. So what we've been able to do is any spare money that we've had, we've saved like crazy. And we've been building up this little nest egg. And now we're in a position where we can take some time off work and do some traveling. And that's been the whole idea of this van build. I haven't been able to say too much at the beginning because I didn't really want the word to get out to work and so forth. Obviously we still needed our jobs at the time. But I can tell you now that last week I handed my notice in. So in five weeks time, I'm gonna be a full-time van lifer. And the plan is to take this van on a one year tour around Europe. We've had this map of Europe hanging up in our kitchen for quite a few months now while we've been contemplating this trip and while we've been saving for it and dreaming about where we would go. And every so often we take a pin and stick it in somewhere where we'd really like to go and visit. Somewhere where we haven't seen before, but always fancied doing it. And now we've got the opportunity. We've budgeted for a year. We've saved enough money that we reckon we can support ourselves for a year without any other outside sources. So the plan is in the next couple of months to complete the van build and then we'll be leaving England on a one year tour around Europe. I'm still gonna keep the YouTube channel going and I really would like you guys to come along with us, follow our travels, and I'm gonna be putting out a weekly video diary on where we are and just general van life and what it's like to live in a van full time. And I wanna cover some of the points that people maybe don't cover, uh, some of the good points and some of the bad points, the highs and the lows. So. I'm really looking forward to this trip. It's a little bit scary. We've never done anything like this before, but it's also extremely exciting. And I really hope that you guys will follow me along this trip. I've really enjoyed reading all your comments and there's been some fantastic feedback on the van build so far. And I just really hope that you continue to follow us on our trip. I know a lot of you are also doing your own van builds and a lot of you will also aspire to do something like we are. So hopefully we can be a little bit of inspiration to yourselves when you're doing your own van build that one day you will also be doing these kind of trips of a lifetime. This really is going to be a life-changing thing for us. 
both myself and my partner have handed our notice in at work. We've got about just over a month to work our notice out. So my last working day will be Friday the 29th of June. I've got probably a couple of weeks to sort out paperwork and insurances and just get all of our paperwork in place for when we actually go abroad. Make sure we tidy up things with our house. Um, most of our possessions and that are going into storage and we're actually letting go of the house on the 7th of July. Come the middle of July we will be not only uh, jobless but we'll be living in the van full time. So scary times but also exciting times and I'm really really looking forward to it. I cannot wait. It's one of these things that you think yeah I'll do that when I retire but I'm 50 now. I mean I've probably got another 15, 17 years till I retire, but who knows what's going to happen in that time. I'm quite fit and able at the moment, so why not do it now when I can enjoy it? Why wait until I'm 65 when I may not be able to enjoy it? I don't know what's going to happen in the future. So I want to take full advantage of the time that I've got now and I want to do this trip while I can really make the most of it and really enjoy it. We visited quite a few places in Europe, but there's a lot that we haven't seen. So if any of you guys have been to any places that you can recommend, please leave a comment down below. Leave your place names or a link to a certain site or somewhere that you think would be of interest for us to go and visit. I'm open to any suggestions. I've spoken to a few people that have done some long term traveling and quite a few of them have said the plan is to have no plan. and really to just go with the flow and that's fully what we intend to do. We've got a few places as you can see that we do want to visit on our travels but I think generally we're just going to go wherever we want to go. We may be in a little restaurant or a bar somewhere, we'll be chatting to a local and they'll say to us oh you must go and see this place and we're just going to go off and go and have a look at it and I think that's going to be the best part of this whole trip is the freedom just to do whatever we want to do. Having this off-grid van is going to be super helpful as well. We're going to be totally self-sufficient. We're going to be able to generate our own electricity. We'll have our own water supply, our own shower, toilet, and we'll be completely self-sufficient. So we can probably get into quite remote places in Europe. So that's another part that I'm really looking forward to. So I think you can see there's been absolutely masses of things going on in the background behind this YouTube channel, which I know everybody has not been aware of, but we've had so much to prepare with, you know, work commitments with our house and just organizing the trip and the van build as well, along with all the festivals and everything else. So you can see, you know, making the films, video editing, we've been super, super busy. So please excuse me for not putting a couple of videos up in the last couple of weeks. We just had uh, you know, a lot of things to organise, but I'm really pleased to announce now the trip is definitely on. You know, In a couple of months time, we are gonna be full-time van lifers and we're gonna be starting our European trip of a lifetime. So please do follow along. I hope you enjoy the videos that we put out. I know we've had some fantastic comments and I can't thank you guys enough for all of the feedback that you've given us so far. I've got loads of videos still to do on the van build. I know everybody's been enjoying that. I'm going to continue in the same detail with every aspect of the van build. So those of you who are doing your own van conversions, there'll be loads more videos to come on the completion of this vehicle. So there's plenty more to look forward to on that side of things before we even start going on the trip. So it just remains for me to say thanks very much for watching. I really appreciate everybody who's joined the channel. If you're new to the channel, please do make sure that you subscribe. We've got loads of really good content coming up in the near future, and it'd be really great to have you along with us. See you soon. Cheers.